Breaking news coming into our newsroom just now. We've learned that a well-known storm chaser, his son, and another storm chaser all killed in Friday night storms. And KOCO's Dan Thomas is live. So, Dan, uh, you just spoke with Good Morning America's meteorologist Ginger Z about the news. What did she have to say? That's right, guys. You know, Ginger Z, before she got the job at Good Morning America, she was a storm chaser. She often chased with Tim Samaras, his son, and Carl Young, all three killed. Uh, here in Canadian County due to that storm on Friday. Uh, Samaras, a uh, well-known meteorologist, uh, often featured on places like the Discovery Channel. Uh, ABC News featured him a number of times as well. It, it kind of like the movie Twister, he would put out those discs uh, hoping that they got caught up by the storm and take accurate measurements. Uh, not the most flashy of storm chasers by reputation. He was really in it for the science, uh, not a big risk taker either, uh, according to Ginger Z. Uh, she said oftentimes uh, people would kind of uh, give him a little bit of a ribbing for being too conservative. Uh, you know, they'd say, well, if you would have just been a, a little more of a risk taker, you could have gotten this picture or that picture. He was really in it for the science, uh, according to Ginger. I spoke to her a little bit earlier, guys. She's been out here the last couple of mornings. Uh, alongside of us, she's been reporting for Good Morning America at this same location that we've been at. Uh, the last few mornings out here at the Canadian Valley Technical Center. Uh, take a listen to what she had to say about Samaras and Carl Young and Samaras' son, Paul. Out of every single thing that people say about this today, I hope they realize that Tim was the best out there, the most respected, the most conservative, and uh, he was only trying to do great things. Yeah. Uh, what do you think? Does this make you think twice about chasing? Do you think it'll change the way people chase? No. Uh, I don't definitely doesn't change my perspective. I, I would storm chase forever. Um, I love storms, probably not even close to as much as Tim did, uh, and Carl and his son. Um, so no, it won't change it at all. Yeah, three men who died doing what they really truly had a passion in life for. Ginger Z adamant that nothing should change as a result of this. She doesn't think that. Tim would want that, and she hopes that people continue to learn from this stuff, learn more about this specific incident. She thinks that it just doesn't make any sense that how conservative, how safe he was. She thinks there must have been another factor out there, perhaps vehicle trouble. We just don't know at this point, guys. But at this point, the news of those storm chasers' deaths uh, really hitting home uh, for the entire meteorological community, really the entire news community this morning, guys. Reporting live in Canadian County, Dan Thomas, KOCO 5 News.